and he got straight back to me and he said, yes, I have a moon buggy. <laughs> Hello and welcome to the video. In this video, I'm going to explain how much of an idiot I am. So if you're a regular viewer, you may know that recently I picked up a big bundle of Peppa Pig toys. I split that big bundle down into five separate lots and we've now sold all of it but I made a big mistake. One of the lots was a train that we sold to a viewer, Simon. Simon, if you're watching, you know what I'm gonna say. <laughs> um, I actually showed it in a video um, when I was picking orders that day. I couldn't find the train because I'd put the train, the Peppa Pig train, in the same box as the Peppa Pig rocket. I eventually figured that out, picked the box off the shelf, pulled the rocket out, put the rocket back on the shelf, put a load of void fill in and shipped off the train. Then we sold the rocket. So I picked the rocket off the shelf, had all the little figures inside it. I think I showed that in a video as well. Packaged that off, sent that to its new owner. Scroll on a few days the buyer of the rocket got in touch and said hi thank you very much for uh, sending out the rocket however in the listing there was a space buggy i can't find the space buggy so we said well it should have been in uh, in the package have you have you checked in all of the void fill all of the packaging and, and she double checked got back to us like nope no space buggy in there. And then I thought back and I realized pretty quick what I'd done. I'd taken the space rocket out of the box with the train in, left the space buggy in with the train. Sent it to Simon. <laughs> now, if you're gonna sell on eBay in any volume, you will make mistakes like this. Mark my words, you will mess something up. A classic that I do is I send electrical items out without the mains lead, without the manual, or without the remote control. That's a good one, I've done that a few times. Anyway, I, I messaged Simon, who bought the train, and I said, hi Simon, um, perchance did I send an extra item with your train? Is there a little moon buggy in there? And he got straight back to me and he said, yes, I have a moon buggy. <laughs> So I explained how I'd messed it up and I said to him, can you do me a big favor and pop that in the post to the person that bought the rocket who is missing a moon buggy. And thank you so much, Simon, if you are watching, um, for being so helpful and doing that for me. Obviously I refunded Simon off his original order, the cost of the shipping for the for the moon buggy to its new owner. Um, I have since had a message from the buyer of the rocket who is very happy. They have received it and everything is good. So I guess I wanted to share this for two reasons. One, to share that I've been reselling, buying and selling secondhand goods on the internet for 20 years and I still make stupid mistakes because I'm human and I'm a bit of an idiot. It will happen. I should have seen this coming when I when I put two items in the same box. It's just, you know, tempting fate. Anyway, the second reason I wanted to share this story is to remind myself and everyone watching that most people are lovely and helpful and they will help you sort things out. We get so wrapped up in worrying about scammers and people ripping us off on eBay. We forget that most transactions go through smoothly and we're not ripped off. And in this case, when we make a genuine error, most people are fine about it. The person who bought the rocket and didn't receive everything, they didn't kick off. They didn't make a fuss. And they were fine to wait for the rest of their item to arrive. 
And Simon went out of his way to help me out and send the part on to its new owner. So there you go. I'm an idiot, but you knew that already. But in this case, we managed to sort the problem out and all is good in the world. So thank you so much for watching. I'll put another video up here. Um, I can think of at least one where I've shared when I'm being an idiot. So check this video out as well. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye.